okay so this is the second video so now we're going to do is we're going to um, use the, the uh, um, the out of box to connect a um, uh, the Dallas temperature, which is uh, you have to use it through uh, the one wire technology or the I square C technology. So the first thing we have to do is um, connect the uh, switch. The uh, let's see if we can see it here. Switch our uh, left side. Uh, switch block to uh, in order to make the the data on the clock communication in off so that will activate the uh, the I, I square C uh, to communication instead of the IO uh, ports so you can see here we can go and can go right there yeah well enough so this is the first thing we need to do okay second thing we need to do the connection is we need we have our um temperature sensor dallas temperature sensor we're gonna put up um connect uh ground from the other box and we're gonna put this uh voltage and the ground tied together so it's what we have done right here. So we have these two guys connected, data and ground and voltage on the same, right? And the second thing we need to do is uh, the, uh, the data pin, it will go straight to the SDA pin which is pin 2 for the Arduino and it's pin number uh, is the SDA pin 2 in this case we're not using the SCL pin why? because we just have one uh, device connected okay so this is basically this is the uh, see, a little bit of focus here you can see the resistor connected to to uh, there you go connected to my data pin and so there you have it so that's the complete connection we have the uh, power line here 5 volts power we have the data connected and we have the ground connected here just beside the, this black cable here connected to the, uh, the second pin right and the other side we have connection to uh, the other box to the 12 volts uh, power supply which is our power supply right here right so and this is basically what you need to connect and here All right so let's see now uh, the programming part okay for the program part and this is just a basic because we as I say we just have a um, one device connected so we don't need anything else on so to start we just need to call the library we just bring this sample and I just come in what I don't need so I have the one wire library here and the library for the Dallas temperature connection right and I just define one wire connection to bus number two that's the SDA connection for the bus on my other box right next is the one wire I just uh, activate the the bus to the uh, say that it's on the port number two and um, the Dallas temperature so I will call a sensor right right here what's called a sensor is one wire you have to use the ampersand 
that's uh, C++ requirement right so next time because I'm just using one connection I uh, I comment the rest so they are they are not working so I just say my device address is uh, I call it the inside temperature and this is the address of the temperature if I see a sensor right here and I put a little label with the uh, with the, the name the number you can there's a sample where you can pull out the number for the sensors and here's my waterproof sensor okay so and then uh, we just start very easy very simple program right with uh, on the voice setup I just uh, start uh, the serial communication so I can send the data to the screen and I just uh, activate the sensor resolution which is pass the address to the uh, to the uh, to the um, uh, to the audio box so and I said this the size of the address is and very easy just to get a temperature I just need to do this so I just need to uh, create a variable called temperature C and then I say get temperature C from the device address I'm looking for and uh, just in case there's an error I say send an error temperature and on the other uh, just print the temperature and the temperature of Fahrenheit. You see Dallas temperature Fahrenheit is this and this is is just to convert it to uh, Fahrenheit. Alright and all my void loop is just a print. I already have that. So it's just uh, requesting the temperature again and printing the temperature. The rest are just comment because I'm not using any of those. And uh, if you go to the program, what I'm sending right now is 20 degrees, which is uh, room temperature. Okay. So what I'm going to do right now, I grab my my sensor here and put it on this uh, little jar with ice inside here. All right. Yeah, we should start seeing the temperatures uh, going down. 17 degrees, 14 degrees, 12 degrees, and keep going down. So it's that's it. That's uh, the connection using one wire. You need to use the library. You need to uh, uh, know the address of your device and um, just. Uh, um, get the temperature by requesting temperature and convert it if you need to convert it to uh, Fahrenheit. So that's it for today and have a good day. Bye.